It's time for person, place, or thing. Our first player is Danielle, and her favorite person is Joan Rivers. Our second player is Jeff, and his favorite place is Disneyland. And our third player is Kasaya, and her favorite thing is her shoe collection. And now, because the only time she doesn't have to slouch is when everyone else is on a raised platform, our host, Melissa Peterman! I finally feel petite! Welcome to Person, Place, or Thing, the game where paying attention really pays off. Joining me today, I've got three contestants who are here to battle it out for their shot to win our grand prize of $5,000. <laughs> And back for a third consecutive day, it's our returning champion, Danielle, who's won hotel stays to the Maya Riviera and Puerto Rico. But I know she's hoping to make it back to that final round and win that $5,000. But I'm guessing that Jeff and Kasaya are looking to start a winning streak of their own. Let's get started. In our first round, we are going to play each category, a person, a place, and a thing. You can ask me yes or no questions, and I will be giving you clues. Let's get started. Welcome back, Danielle. Thank you. Day three, is it third time's a charm? I'm hoping. You're hoping? I know you're hoping. Joan Rivers, yes. I love her too. She was amazing. Uh, when, did you, when did you first fall in love with Joan Rivers? When I was a little kid, I used to watch her on the red carpet, and then I discovered her stand-up and her late-night hosting, and from there, it just, she became my favorite person. Yeah, amazing work ethic. I mean, she paved the way. She was amazing. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, we're gonna start off this round with our thing category, and this thing is a movie. Is this movie a cartoon? No, it is not. Kasaya. Hi. Welcome to Person, Place, or Thing. Thank you. You're happy to be here. Uh, so I have to ask, how many shoes in the shoe collection? I think we're at 195 right now. Oh, God. <laughs> Can I come over and look? For sure. <laughs> OK, well, what size do you wear? <laughs> I'm a nine. <laughs> so am I. We'll be talking. <laughs> OK, we have that uh, thing here. We're talking about a movie, and it is not a cartoon. Can this be classified as a children's movie? No. Mm -mm. Hi, Jeff. Hi. How are you? I'm good. Welcome to Person, Place, or Thing. Thank you. I'm, I'm very glad you're here, because usually I, don't, I think you wouldn't be here. You might be at Disneyland, right? <laughs> it's one of the places I've liked to spend a lot of time. That's your favorite place. And do you hold the record for most consecutive days at the park? That's correct. How many days is that? Uh, in February, Guinness World Record presented the title for t uh, having 2,995 consecutive days going to Disneyland. Um, wait, what? Yes. Do they let you in for free now? No, not anymore. I mean, when you come up to Space Mountain, they're like, oh, <laughs> hey, Jeff, come on up. They know you? There was a, quite a few cast members that I knew at the time. Okay, well, I'm glad that you decided to come here instead of Disneyland. Thank you. But we promised to make it as exciting as Space Mountain, okay? <laughs> All right. All right, so we're talking about a thing. It's a movie. It's not a children's movie. Is this movie a horror movie? No. Mm -mm. Time for a clue. Get your buzzers out. Remember, if you buzz in, you get it right. You got 100 points. If you're wrong, you're out until I give another clue. This 1996 Coen Brothers film won two Oscars. Danielle. Fargo? It is Fargo. And I will give you no bonus points, but my undying appreciation if you can tell me who played hooker number two in that Oscar winning movie. Was it you? Yes, <laughs> it was me. <laughs> Thank you. That was a risky guess. That, was it a risky guess? Oh, yeah. I'm very proud of hooker number two. I'm proud too. Yeah, it, I could have been number one if they would have given me a shot. <laughs> All right, enough about me. Let's get on that. Show. All right, Kasaya. Okay, our next category is our person category. I can tell you this person is an athlete. Is this person male? Yes. Jeff. Does this person play a team sport? Yes. Danielle. Does this person play football? Yes. Time for a clue. Buzzer's out. This NFL quarterback was drafted by the Indianapolis Colts in 1998. Jeff. Is it uh, Pey uh, Peyton Manning? It is Peyton Manning. Great job, Jeff, 100 points to you. And you are gonna kick off our last category in this round, which is our place category. Jeff, I can tell you this place is a U.S. city. Is this place on the West Coast? No. Danielle. Is this place in New England? No. Kasaya. 
Is this place on the East Coast? Yes. Time for a clue. This place is home to the NASCAR Hall of Fame. Danielle? Daytona? It is not Daytona, which means you're out until I give another clue. Jeff, not Daytona. Is this place in North Carolina? Yes, it is. Danielle, since you are out for this round until I give a clue, Kasai, it's to you. Is this place considered a major city? Yes, I would say so. Time for a clue, get your buzzers out. It's the largest city in North Carolina. <laughs> Jeff, I thought you were gonna get that one because I'm you asked on, about. I was blanking on the name. North I, Carolina, I, well, I have it my head, does it come to you now? Because you can guess right now if you'd like to. Is it along the coastline of North Carolina? No. Danielle. Is it Charlottesville? No. It's not in North Carolina? <laughs> no, okay, all right. Kasaya. Mm. Is it Charlotte? It is Charlotte! <laughs> not Charlottesville, Charlotte. Well done, Kasaya. I like this kind of game. Everybody's on the board. Great round, everybody. Danielle, Kasaya, and Jeff are all on the board with 100 points. But up next, even more great questions, great clues when we come back on person, place, or thing. Go Bears! He looked like the fun Marlboro man, but maybe I'm just saying that because he smoked a lot of them. Do you want to learn more about our show and meet today's super fan? Use your smartphone to scan the QR code in the corner of your screen and you will not only meet today's super fan, Tina, but you're going to get access to behind the scenes fun and bonus content. Welcome back to Person, Place, or Thing. Her contract requires at least one Fargo reference per episode. It's Melissa Peterman. Go Bears! Welcome back. I love this kind of game. Everyone on the board, 100 points. But let's start round two. We play round two the same as our first round, except we're gonna double the points, and you can pick the category that we're gonna play. Danielle, you are up first. What category would you like to play? I'm gonna play person. Person, okay. This person is an actor. Is this person a woman? Yes. Mm-hmm. Kasaya. Is this person above the age of 50? No. Mm-mm. Jeff. Is this place, or sorry, is this actor an Oscar winner? No. Mm -mm. Time for a clue. Get your buzzers out. Remember, this round, it's worth 200 points. This person was married to a four-time All-NBA basketball player. All right, Danielle. Is this actress known for her work on television? Yes, I would say so. Kasaya. Does this um, actress identify as a person of color? Yes. Mm -hmm. Jeff. Is this actress a dra in drama? Like no. primarily no, in drama? Yeah, no, known for drama series. Yeah, she's known for a drama series. Okay, time for a clue. She played Gabrielle Solis on Desperate Housewives. Danielle. Eva Longoria. Yes, indeed. Well done, 200 points to you. I love her. I know, I love her too. I love her. She's great, she's phenomenal. Okay, Kasaya, you get to start this next category. What would you like to play? Let's go with Thing. Thing, okay. This thing is at the beach. Um, is this an item you can touch? Yes. Mm -hmm. Jeff. Is this thing naturally part of the beach? No. Mm -mm. Danielle. Is this something people walk on at the beach? No. Mm -mm. Get your buzzers out. Time for a clue. This thing is featured on the cover of several albums by the Beach Boys. Surfboard. Yes, indeed, surfboard. Another 200 points to you, great job. Mm -hmm. you. Okay, Jeff, last but not least, you get to pick the category. What would you like to play? Let's go for a place. Place, okay. This place is an island. Is this a US island? Yes. Is this island in the state of New York? 
No, it is not. Yes, I am. Is this island a popular tourist destination? Yeah. Yeah, it is. Buzzer's out. Time for a clue. This affluent summer colony is located off the coast of Massachusetts. Danielle? Nantucket. It is not Nantucket, which means you are out until I give another clue. Jeff. Is it Rhode Island? It is not Rhode Island. I'm skipping you, Danielle. So, Kasaya, on to you. What do you think? Is the weather warm year-round? Warm year-round? No, not year-round. It is not. Time for a clue. Get your buzzers out. Much of the blockbuster film Jaws was filmed here. Danielle? Martha's Vineyard. Oh, my. Did you get a Boston accent right when you just <laughs> said that? That was amazing. You heard it, Kasaya, <laughs> didn't you? I was like, where was she the rest of the game? Oh, my gosh. Fantastic job. Another 200 points. Say it again. Martha's Vineyard. Martha's Vineyard. <laughs> I, 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 I butchered it. All right. Great job, everybody. Oh, Another fantastic round. Great game. Our returning champ, Danielle, is in the lead with 700 points. Uh, Kasaya and Jeff are tied at 100 points. But up next, we're going to speed things up and see who's going to walk away a winner on person, place, or thing. Martha's Vineyard. If you're a person who wants to come to this place and do this thing, go to person, place, or thing on TV.com, and I'll see you here. Welcome back to Person, Place, or Thing, where it's delightful to have players who know sports. <laughs> Great game here. Danielle in the lead with 700 points. Kasai and Jeff are tied at 100, but that could all change because it's time for our speed round. So get your buzzers out. Get your buzzer fingers ready to go. I'm going to read you a series of clues about a person, a place, or a thing. If you think you know it, buzz in. If you're right, you got 500 points. If you're wrong, you are out until the next category. So be careful when you buzz in. We have a lot of points up for grabs here. It is truly anybody's game. Are you ready? Okay, Jamie, put 90 seconds on the clock, please. Martha's Vineyard. <laughs> Good luck, everybody. Time starts now. This European city is where the snow globe was invented. Mozart died at his home here in 17... Jeff. Uh, what is... Um, Time's Austria. up. A university located here was attended by Sigmund Freud and is associated with 16 Nobel Prize winners. It's the largest city in... UCLA. Kisaya. UCLA? Uh, no, it's the largest city in Austria. Anyone? Uh, Vienna. This band was formed by contestants on the UK version of The X Factor. Danielle. One Direction. Yes, this mythological place is where Valhalla is located. It's the Nordic equivalent of Mount Olympus. It was incorporated into the Marvel Universe in a 1962 comic book. It's where the Avenger Thor is from. Uh, Jeff. Asgard. Yes. This thing is a type of pasta. Each piece has a small pocket containing various fillings. You might... Danielle. Ravioli. Yes. This actress and comedian is known for playing quirky characters. She is the voice of Louise Belcher on Bob's Burgers. She was a woman's issues correspondent on The Daily Show with Jon Stewart. She's known for roles on 30 Rock and Flight of the Concords. Anyone? Kristen Schaal. This person is a Golden Globe winning TV star. She played Rainbow, the matriarch of the Johnson family on Blackish. She's a daughter of music legend Diana Ross. Joan Messiah. Rivers. Joan Rivers? No. A former model, she rose to acting prominence on the sitcom oh. Girlfriends. Anyone? Tracy Alice Ross. This thing is used for cleaning. It has different cycle options, such as a normal or heavy duty. Danielle. Vacuum. Vacuum. Vacuum, no. No, no, no. Sorry, Danielle, we were looking for dishwasher. Oops. Yep, you buzz in too soon. Great round, everybody, but guess what? Danielle, you maintain and you are still our champ. You are moving on to play our final round. Kasaya and Jeff, I loved having you here. I hope you guys had a good time. We did. Jeff, I'll see you at Disneyland. <laughs> uh, Kasaya will be over to talk shoes anytime. <laughs> We are not going to send you home empty-handed. Jamie, tell them what they've won. <laughs> Indulge with Lobster Graham, delivering freshest lobster, giant king crab legs, colossal shrimp, flavorful hand-cut steak, side dishes, and desserts right to your door. Make gift-giving effortless with lobstergram.com. I love that.
Who's at the door? Lobster! Love it. Congratulations, Danielle. You're moving on to play for $5,000 in our final round, sponsored by Slotomania. Jamie, tell them about it. Promotional consideration provided by Slotomania, the number one free slots game. Download Slotomania now and get one million free coins. All right, let's see if third time's a charm. Stick around to see if Danielle is going to win that $5,000. We'll be back right after this. Now it's your turn to play. Scan the QR code to win this amazing prize. A $200 Tommy Bahama gift card with 21 restaurants and bars and over 160 shops. You've never been closer to living the island life. Make every day a vacation day at TommyBahama.com. Good luck. Welcome back to the final round of Person, Place, or Thing. <laughs> I'm standing here with Danielle, who's about to play for $5,000 from our friends at Slotomania. Jamie Tell them about it. Ah, uh, Slotomania, the number one free-to-play slots game in the world with millions of players and non-stop fun and excitement. Scan the QR code to download Slotomania now and find out what will today spend. Thank you, Jamie. Okay, third time's the charm. I feel it, I believe it. You know what you gotta do, Danielle. You've got two amazing hotel stays, but wouldn't it be nice to have some spending cash to bring along? Absolutely. It sure would. Yeah. So, here's what you're gonna do. You are going to correctly identify a person, a place, and a thing in 60 seconds. You may start with any category that you'd like. Ask me as many yes or no questions as you need to. Guess as many times as you desire. And Danielle, I got three clues waiting for you. Use them, use them wisely. You correctly identify your person, your place, and your thing. You got $5,000 to add to your winnings. Are you ready? Yes. Okay. Your person is an actor. Your place is a U.S. state, and your thing is technology. Where would you like to start? I'll start with place. Place, U.S. state. Jamie, 60 seconds on the clock, please. Danielle, I've been meaning to ask, who are you wearing? <laughs> Don't answer him. He'll just keep talking. Good luck to you, Danielle. Your time starts now. Is it on the East Coast? No. Is it on the West Coast? Yes. Is it Oregon? Yes. Okay. It is it something you can touch? Yes. Is it a computer? No. Cell phone? No. Beeper? No. Is it a fax machine? No. Clue? This revolutionary music playing device was introduced in 2001. Is it an iPod? Yes. Okay. Uh, is it a man? Yes. Is it? Oh, is he over 60? Yes, you have, you have clues. Oh, give me a clue. This action movie legend wrote and starred in 1977's Oscar winner for Best Picture. Uh, is it uh, Robert Redford? No, you have another clue? Uh, give me a clue. He was inducted into the Boxing Hall of Fame in 2011. Is it Muhammad Ali? No. Oh, it's, uh, um, oh my gosh, you can... wait, I got this. Um, uh, Adrian Rocky, mm -hmm. it's, um. Yes, yes. His name, oh gosh, what is his name? Um, uh, I don't know. Oh! Man, I wish we could do that for Adrian! Okay, I know. Sylvester Stallone. Oh, it was Sylvester right there. Stallone. Right there at the tip of your tongue. Beautiful job. Beautiful job, Danielle. <laughs> so we're not going to send you home empty handed. We could not do that. Oh. Jamie, tell her what she's won. Westward Loop Wyndham Grand Resort and Spa, situated on 80 acres of Desert Oasis. This upscale resort offers a sophisticated southwestern getaway in the heart of the Sonoran Desert. Enjoy a host of amenities like a full service spa, three pools, and nature trails. WyndhamRewards.com, the world's number one hotel rewards program. I can see by your face you have loved these. You've now got three hotel stays and Danielle, you are coming back to play for another chance to win $5,000 as our returning champion. And remember people, call another person. Invite them over to your place and together watch this thing. See you next time. Adrian! Adrian! Let's hear it. Let's do it. You're still watching? Oh my God, thank you. Well, in that case, be sure to stay up to date with Person, Place, or Thing by smashing that subscribe button. There's full episodes, behind the scenes content, and even a few surprises, and they're just a click away. You can go now.